Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Virgo? This is a nighttime energy reading, but this can be any time for anyone. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come across this reading. I hope everyone is staying safe. I love you guys. How are y'all doing, Virgo? I love you guys. Thank y'all so much for your beautiful comments. Thank you so much for loving me and your sincere, heartfelt uh, comp compliments. Thank you so much. Um, I notice a lot of people want to see me more and, um, I'm going to work on that. <laughs> I'm going to work on that. I am reserved Virgo, um, <laughs> to new cross watches, uh, to new viewers, cross watches, please come on in take what resonates, leave the rest for someone else. Okay. I love you guys. I need you to stay with me. There are lessons, blessings, and confirmations. Thank you, spirit guys. Confirmations in all of my readings. So my beautiful Virgos, I want to say this before I get started because y'all know I love you and I'm going to say what I have to say. Okay. Now, I don't know if a lot of you know, uh, if some of you don't realize that I have a lot of Virgo placements in my chart, I am a Virgo. Okay. Let's go ahead and clear that out the way. Now, a lot of you been on this journey with me for a lot uh, since I started. Okay. And I've been on this journey probably three years now. Okay. Three and a half years. So, um, a lot of you have been with me now. This channel is all about respect. Okay. Each other, myself, but, um, I believe in the old saying, it's not what you say is how you say it. It's not what you say is how you say it. And I would not be disrespected. I would not be talked to any kind of way. You would not come on here with any negative energy. And I'm not saying it is, that it's the ones that has, that is with me. I'm putting it out there to new viewers, cross watchers, new subscribers. You won't come on here and you will not think that you're going to say anything to me any kind of way. Okay. Because I will block you. I will block you. I'm not going to argue. I'm not going to go back and forth with anybody because what I'm doing, I'm doing this because this is what God wants me to do is to help heal souls. And I will not allow anyone to come on here and disrupt, disrupt anybody's healing journey. Okay. I am here to speak life into you. I am here to help you heal your heart so that you can become a better person. But I will not be disrespected in any kind of way. Like I say, it's not what you say, it's how you say it. Okay? So the comment, you know, if this person is wondering why they don't see me, it's because I blocked them. And I'm not going to go back and forth with nobody. And I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't do that kind of energy. I'm not even going to say anything back, but I will respect you because you did, because I don't, it, you can say what you want to say on here. It's not what you say is how you say it. And I'm going to make sure I say that to every sign that I do. It's not what you say is how you say it. Okay. And I would take that as you're not trying to be sarcastic to me. You're not trying to, trying to you know, bring negative energy towards me because I'm going to tell you right now, I am definitely a high priestess and I am definitely an empress. And when you come against me with ill intentions, I don't care how small it is. You can bet your butt that you're going to reap what you sow. Period. Karma going to smack you dead in the face because my intentions on this channel is to help everybody navigate throughout their life. OK, now I, I'm not talking to the ones that, you know, I'm not, it's a lot of y'all I'm not talking to. I'm talking to that very percentage that you think you could say anything to me any kind of way. That ain't happening. And we ain't going to blame it on the trolls. We're going to blame it on people's their 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 intentions because you having a bad day and you think you're going to come on this channel. You're going to be, you know, trying to find everything that you can say and irk whatever type of attitude that you're in and you think you're going to bring it my way. Mm -mm, it ain't happening. Now let's get started. Don't y'all forget that it is the first week of August. The, today, do as I'm video, video in this Virgo. Okay. Some of you is a little stuck as I'm video on this. 
Uh, it's time to manifest. It's time to manifest some abundance. It's time to manifest. This is the first of the month. It's time for you to call in. It's time for you to manifest, 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 manifest. Okay? So let's see what's in your energy. I love you guys, but I just have to say some stuff sometimes. And no, I don't let it bother me. I don't. I ain't worrying about 44K. I ain't worried about 50K, 60, 70K. My mind is not on numbers. My mind is on helping people heal. I rather have less people that are genuine and loyal to me than to have a whole bunch of people coming into my channel with negative energy. I don't give a crap about uh, uh, you got this many subscribers or that. I don't I don't look at that. I look at people what they need. They need a lot of people needs to to understand. They want to learn how to heal themselves. I am here to help heal the broken. I'm not here looking at numbers. Now, other people can be watching my numbers if that's on them. I'm not here to do that. I'm here to help to heal. My intentions is good. And when you come towards me, try to come against me, you can rest assured. You can rest assured that my ancestor with high vibration, my spirit guides and God ain't going to play. I'm just saying. So let's get some manifestation going. Let's see what's in your energy, Virgo. Let's see what's in your energy. Spirit guides, this is for Virgo. Let's see what's going on in your energy, my beautiful souls. You're on the right path, Virgo. Okay? You're on the right path. Divine timing. Things are going to happen in divine timing. You're on the right path. I know. I know it seems like you're not. I know it do. I, let me tell you something, Virgo. Sometimes when we don't see, we can't see things. We can't see what God, whoever your higher source sees. And sometimes it may seem dark. It may seem bumpy and you questioning, am I on the right path? Or does it supposed to be this way? Well, why is it doing this? Or why am I going through this? If I'm on this new journey, if I'm on a new healing, if I'm getting ready to start a new beginning of my life, why am I feeling like my foundation is shaking up? Because... It just feels that way. It doesn't mean that you're on the wrong path. Spirit guys, tell me more for Virgo. I love you guys. Virgo, some of you need to get out in nature. Okay. You need to get out in nature. You need to ground yourself. Okay. Spirit guys, tell me more. Mm, thank you. Some of you are angry. But spirit guys are saying, be patient. See these two cards? Some of you are angry. You need to be patient with yourself. You need to be patient with the process. You need to be patient with the divine timing. Okay. Some of you are very angry because you don't understand if this new journey or this new beginning of your life, why does it feel like it's not a new beginning? Okay. Spirit God said, I need you to, I need you to pipe it down. <laughs> You're confused. And Spirit God said, I need you to pipe it down. <laughs> I need you to pipe it down and I need you to, I need you to come to, I, I need you to see the light. I need you to listen. I need you to pipe it down. I don't know who this is for, but spirit guys, whoever your higher source is, I need you to pipe it down because it does not mean that you're on the wrong path. It just means that you, you think you have some challenges that's going on. Okay, and I feel like some of you are very upset about it. You, you're saying, Miss Positive Thoughts of Energy, if this is a new journey, why does it just feel so dark? Why does it feel so dark? Yeah, I know. I get it. Because you don't see what's happening. You're just looking at it through the naked eye. Okay. But Spirit Guides is saying, be patient, Virgo. Things are going to start to level out in your life, okay? Trust your intuition, okay? Trust, it says, your intuition and healing powers will guide you to a better path. Just be careful, okay? Spirit Guides want you to just continue to listen to your intuition, continue to that navigation system as you're going on your path because, you know, we all got, got, got snakes. We got snakes that's lurking around. Thank you, spirit guys. But you're going to be celebrating. And it fell right on the anger card. Spirit guys is saying, I need you to trust where you're headed. You understand what I'm saying? Just because it's bumpy, just because it may feel dark me, and just because it may feel like something just, it just don't make sense to you that you're confused about it. Spirit guys said, I need you to trust this process. <laughs> I don't know who you are right now. But spirit guys, you are ready to bring new and exciting things into your life. I need you to trust that spirit guys, God, whoever your higher source, that you're about to be celebrating 
you're about to get some gifts. You're about to, you know, the light, the, 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 the pathway is about to open up for you, Virgo. Okay? I know it's, it's confusing, but you don't see what God sees. Do you see what I see? You got the world card. Out with the old, in with the new, okay? Be open to new possibilities in all areas of your life. Trust the process. Trust it. Trust the process. I know you waiting. Trust the process. You're about to get these keys. Trust the process. You are about to get these keys. I know it seemed like you're not, but you are about to get these keys. Your new beginning, the world card, out with the old, in with the new. Yes, it may seem a little bumpy. It may seem a little rocky. It even may seem a little dark, but you're about to get these keys. Keys to your abundance, the keys to your happiness. You understand what I'm saying? Spirit God said, I need you to trust. I need you to be patient. I need you to trust the, the, that divine time and everything is going to unfold as it should in your life. Just be patient. Stop being angry. Because what do you think? What do you think this is going to get you, Virgo? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for somebody to answer it. What do you think this card right here going to get you when you're angry? Because God sure don't care. You do the universe don't care about your attitude. <laughs> what is that going to change? Nothing. It's just going to prolong it. You understand? Do you feel what I'm telling you? Do you see what I see? <laughs> Celebration is coming. Your time is coming, sweetheart, sir. Whoever you are, whoever I'm talking to, your time is coming, baby. I just need you to trust the process. Your keys, your success, this whatever this key represents to you, it's all about ab abundance. It's all about your happiness, but it's coming. Celebration is here. You're going to be celebrating. You're going to be so overwhelmed and happy about the keys. You're going to get exactly what you want. So uh, go ahead and, and, and let this and, and pipe it down. Pipe it down and have patience. Trust the process because it, you got new possibilities. You're in a new journey. You own the right path. It's just it's just right now. It's confusing some of y'all. You don't understand it. If this is a new journey, Miss Paul's the thoughts of energy. Why is it so dark? Why does I seem like I, I you know, just trust it? Just put your seatbelt on and trust it, sweetheart, sir. Okay? A lot of celebration. You're about to, you're about, do you see this gift box? This is a present. This is a present. You see the light coming out of that? This is the spirit, guys. God, whoever your higher source, is about to bring you these keys. And the key says new beginnings, directions, and adventures await for those ready to let go of the past. Let go. Let go. Don't worry about that. Allow, allow the universe, God, whoever your highest source is, to unfold this as it should. I don't know who this is for. You're going to get the money. This is for somebody. You're going to get the money to achieve whatever it is that you're wanting. You're going to get the money. Just just let it unfold like it should. It's all going to happen in divine timing. Be patient. Go on with your life. Carry on with your life. Do what it is that you're doing and allow God, universe, Archangel Michael, ancestral high vibration, whoever you believe in, let them work this thing out. Okay. It says progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved. You're going to get that money. <laughs> yeah, I know. I love you too. I do. So it's coming. Just trust the process. That's all you got to do. Have faith. Have faith and trust the process. Spirit guys, talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me, spirit guys. Thank you. Allow. Exactly. Allow. Oh my goodness. Woo. Allow, baby. First card popped out, Virgo, is allow. It says, I allow abundance to flow into my life each day from limitless opportunities, circumstances, and events. Allow spirit guides universe to bring this thing, to make this thing happen for you. 
Okay, being angry and upset at God or whoever your higher source does not make it come in no faster is what God is saying. Being angry does not change any outcome. What you think it's going to do because you're mad, because you're angry, because you want it when you want it, because you want it now. That's going to make spirit, God's universe, whoever you believe in, going to make you just, oh, no, they ain't ready for it. The attitude that she got, the attitude that he got, they ain't getting it. I'll take my time. Let me move over to the next person that, that has faith in me and has faith in, and has patience. I'm going to move over here and give them their blessing. Because right now you all in your feelings and you angry and you feeling some kind of way because you don't understand. You confuse why something ain't happening in your life and that ain't going to move it forward. <laughs> I'm just saying. And you got attachments here. I will no longer hold attachments. I will allow myself, the universe, and the ascendant masters to work in the harmony on all my heart's desire. Okay? Letting go of attachments. Letting go of things that no longer serve you. And allow the universe, confirmation, to work this thing out. Okay? Yes, you have let go of the attachments. Okay? You're, you're, left, you, you're in a new world. Okay? It surely shows me that you have closed out a cycle. Now, allow God or whoever you hire yourself to do this. And you have power for here. I am a powerful co-creator who succeeds in all that I do each day. Very powerful. Okay, let me make sure I got my cards here right. Okay. So being angry ain't going to change anything, sweetheart. Allow the universe, allow God to do what it has to do. To unfold this, you're going to get the money, the gold, the money. You're going to celebrate. You're going to get this. Uh, the, you're going to get this. Okay. You're going to achieve this. Okay. Celebration is here. You're going to get the keys. You're going to get the money to get whatever, the, you know, if this is a house, if this is getting a key, you know, you're going to have the keys. You're going to do goals or whatever you have set out in your life. It's going to be achieved. Just be patient. Spirit guys, talk to me. Tell me more. For Virgo. Tell me more for Virgo. If I don't feel it, I won't pick it up. Spirit guys will bring it back out if it's meant for it to come. All right. That's phew. That throw that went when I tell you that went out there like. Okay. Whew. So the card that came out is break free, Virgo. Break free. It says you are being asked to break free from the tribe. Uh, in order to live your authentic life. This isn't easy, but it is very necessary. If you're going to share your true self with others, be brave, be real, be you. And trust that those who love you will always be there for you. Okay. So with this, with this break free, this attachment, you know, it's time to break free. Some of you are holding on to something. OK, if you're holding on tight to something, it's time to let it go. Break it free. OK, whatever you're attached to, it's time to, you know. And uh, trust that those who have your that who love you will always be there for you. OK. Spirit guys, talk to me. grounded so you got this twice with the nature card i said a lot of you need to go, go out and, and ground yourself so that definitely has a lot to do with nature walking barefooted you know getting near ocean and water ground yourself trees okay um and it says you're being asked to ground yourself virgo you've been spending too much time in your in your head some of you are really overthinking you get you know you you just want an outcome it's like you want it now you've been into you've been in your head too much okay and it's time to pay attention to your body and to the earth go outside and plant your feet on the ground and enjoy the um the centering feeling this brings you okay this is going to get you out of the overthinking because virgo you know you overthink because you know what i overthink <laughs> yes <laughs> <laughs> so definitely okay so get out and ground yourself okay pay attention okay pay attention you're being asked to pay extra close attention to the signs you are being given both the subtile ones and the ones that cannot be missed these signs will help you see how to best move 
uh, forward in order to live your best life. So, you know, pay attention to the signs, pay attention to how you navigate life. You know, watch out for the snakes. This is what spirit guides God is saying. Okay. Ground yourself. Okay. Bravery. Bravery is here. You're being asked to make a tough decision that you've been pondering over, pondering of because of fear, which is understandable. But you do have the strength and bravery to make this decision and you will feel so much lighter when you do. Some of you need to break free from something and you feel like, if you know, by holding on to it that, you know, but be, when you break free, you're not going to realize how how free you're going to feel. So it's something that you're holding on to. I don't know what it is. It can be somebody that you're in a situation with, but whatever this is, you're definitely spirit guides that saying, let it go. Okay. This can be a friends will better be benefit can be a sexual partner. Let it go. And it's time to move forward. Okay. Um, the spirit of God is also saying, keep going. Don't stop now. Okay. Just because you seems like you are on a bumpy road doesn't mean that you are. Okay. So it says, um, it may feel as though that you've been on this path and journey for a long, for so long. And you may even wonder if you're making any progress towards your dreams. You remember what I said? It's like, it's like, this is a new journey. Why does it seem like things are not falling in place? Why? I don't understand Miss Paul's thoughts in it. It seems that way, but it's not. Spirit guides are saying, keep going. Okay. It says, um, this message is a loving reminder for you to keep going. You almost there. Okay. Don't stop. Trust the process. Trust what God has for you. Trust what universe has for you. Trust what your higher source have for you, Virgo. Let's see what's, let's see what's coming. Okay. All right. Let's see. Star card came out, popped out Aquarius sign. Okay. The sun card. Okay. Happiness. Okay. Look at that. The money is coming. The money is coming. You've done a lot of healing, a lot of work. The money is coming. You on the right path. Stability is coming. You about to have a stable foundation. Things are about to be stable in your life. You're going to be happy. You're going to be celebrating. Keep going. The money is coming. The money is coming. Collaboration. People are talking about it. the money is coming. The stability is coming. Some of you. Yeah, it's definitely coming. Spirit guys talk to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, look at here. Intuition. You feel it. Spirit guys want you to protect your territory. Okay. I feel like you're a little defensive, but the, the whatever this is, it's coming. Okay. Look at here. Persevere. Queen, just hold on. You get ready to persevere through this. See, see this money sitting in your lap? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Any other message? Tell me more. Tell me more for Virgo. Tell me more. Yeah, look at you. Single. Looking good. Okay. A lot of you have released a lot of toxicity out of your life. Okay. You definitely have released. Spirit guys, tell me more. Okay. Yeah. Options. Okay. You're about to, you're about to have some options. Yeah. You walked away. You walked away from something. You got tired of being a fool for somebody, Virgo, and you walked away and you've done a lot of healing. Okay. You got the Virgo card here. You gain a lot of wisdom. You've been in hermit mode for some years. You've been in hermit mode for quite some time. Spirit guys, talk to me. Tell me more for Virgo. Ooh, yeah, you're following your heart. Yeah, you're manifesting something. It's coming in too, Virgo. Whatever you're manifesting, it's coming in. You, some of you could be manifesting. Look at that. You could be manifesting a soulmate that's trying to peep out there. You could be manifesting a soulmate. Yeah. King of Swords here. My goodness. Yeah, you're gonna have to make a decision. You could be manifesting. You gotta make a decision if you want if you want love or not, Virgo. Spirit guys, talk to me. Tell me more. Oh, Virgo. The money is coming. Look at here. And I just said it. Ace of Pentacles. The money's coming. Spirit guys is about to bless you. You manifesting something and it's coming in, but you got to change your attitude. You got to calm down, change your attitude because being angry or upset ain't going to make it come in no faster. Uh, spirit guys, God is telling me you need to shift your energy. You need to go out and ground yourself. And so that you can stop overthinking about this situation because it's, be, it's being worked out. I don't know who you are, but you're about to persevere. Let me tell you something. You're about to have, yeah, the money is coming. You're about to have, 
yeah, you're about to persevere. You're about to have the money in your lap. No more feeling left in the cold. Maybe some of you are left out in the cold. Maybe you have nowhere to go because of some deceit. Uh, something deceit, something happened that was very deceiving. Uh, someone lied to you and you was put in a situation. Um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, that uh, you was left out in the cold, okay? But uh, money is coming. That's what Spirit just keeps saying. The money is coming. I don't know who you are. Yeah, you're definitely in your head about it. But I feel like you have an epiphany, okay? Someone's coming into somebody's life, Virgo. Uh, somebody's coming in your life. Yeah, justice is here, Virgo. Justice is here. It's about to balance you out. Something you're getting. For some of you about to get some money through the court system. But the money is coming. Something is coming towards you, Virgo. Yeah, look at here. It's going to put you in the Empress energy. You've been waiting on this. Some of you have been waiting on a check. You've been waiting on some money. The money is coming. The money is coming. Yeah, you've been all in your head overthinking, overthinking. Spirit God said, I need you to get out and I need you to put your, plant your feet on the ground. I need you to uh, center yourself. I need you to ground yourself so that you can stop overthinking. Okay, you really, really, really been in your head. Really, really been in your head, Virgo. But baby, let me tell you something. This is the world card. Uh, out with the old, in with the new. You're on the right path. You This journey that you're on, you're getting ready to get justice. The money is coming. Some of you, oh yeah, you've done a lot of planting, a lot, of, sowing a lot of seeds in your life. Mm-hmm. Look at here. You also, look, you got somebody that's coming in as well as watching you. Virgo could be an Aries, okay, could make want to do business with you. Or this person definitely, uh, definitely wants stability with you. They could be watching you, but they're going to communication. Some of you about to, yeah, you about to get communication coming in for you, Virgo. Mm -hmm. Look at that. You're not going to see this coming with the two of swords, but your money is coming. It's coming. So change, shift your attitude, shift it. Okay, shift your attitude. Any other message for Virgo? Spirit God says shift your attitude because it's coming. Spirit God is sending it. Yep, Spirit God is sending it. Get that chip off your shoulder. Get the chip off your shoulder, Spirit God is telling me. There is a message coming. Definitely a message coming within eight days, eight hours to eight days. Any other message? Any other message? That is destined. The will is getting ready to start turning in your favor, Virgo. Spirit God said, don't worry. Yeah, you're moving away from rough waters and you're getting ready to land right into where it is that you need to be. Thank you, Spirit, guys. Celebration, strength. Got that celebration card. Yep, you're about to celebrate. You're about to celebrate, Virgo. Yep, look at here. Tower, boom. Look at there. This is going to shock you. Somebody coming in. Yeah. Oh, look at what behind it. I didn't even see that. The wish fulfillment card. I didn't even see that back there. All your wish is about to be granted. Let me tell you, somebody about to gift you. You're about to get some money. Some of you about to get a raise, a promotion, but you're about to get some money. It's going to shock you. And all your wish is about to, you get, you're about to get the money. You see how that card came through there? Did you see it? Did you see it? Did you see what I see? It took some time, but baby, it's on its way. It is coming in fast. This is coming in fast. You getting ready to get your keys. You getting ready to get what is yours. I am positive thoughts and energy. Woo! Did you see that? It's coming in fast, period. Until next time, Virgo.